I'm Sterling. How's your life going? Life could be like this road. It's a long journey. You know, the writer of Hebrews talks about life and says it's a long race or a marathon. There could be hazards, there could be obstacles, twists and turns. It can lead, uh, it can lead to a place that we just didn't even expect. And this is life. It could be like this road. Sometimes it's wearisome. Sometimes it's also empty. Life can leave us hanging. You can chase after things that really lead to nothing, and it's just fruitless. You can chase after money, and then an accident happens, and it's all gone. These things are empty. But what else? We can lose stuff in life. Things that are important and dear to us. Just like this minus sign. So, that could be quite a cynical view of life, but sometimes we go through things that just really frustrate us. Well, how does Jesus deal with this? Jesus said, I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life. No man comes to the Father except through me. So we have this road, and yet with Jesus, it leads to heaven. You know, in John 14, which is where this verse is found, John 14, 6, earlier in the chapter, Jesus is saying to his disciples, saying, I'm going to leave you guys, and I'm going to prepare a place for you, that where I am, you may be also. And what Jesus is saying is, I'm about to die, I'm about to sacrifice myself for the sins of the world, I'm about to die a criminal's death in your place, and yet you know the way. And then Thomas, one of the disciples, asks him, Lord, how are we going to know the way when you're gone? Because this is their rabbi, their master that they've been following. And yet, Jesus says, I am the way. I am the truth, and I am the life. And so, Jesus' promises are true. He's the way. He's the way to heaven. He's also true. He's reliable. He's trustworthy. And so, what he says is legit, and we can believe in it. And he is the life. Just like this plus, kind of like a first aid symbol. He can bless us with the things in natural life, right here in earthly life. And uh, he can also do the miracle of giving us spiritual life. And life that's forgiven, life that's found in him, found in Christ. And so, the application here, what to do? Trust in Jesus. He said he's the only way. And if his words are true, and he gives life, and he's the way, we need to follow him. And that's just the, the beautiful thing about the gospel, is God has provided a way through Jesus Christ. And we can trust in him so that we don't have to know the wrath of God, we can know the blessing of His mercy and grace. Amen. God bless you, and may we all trust in the way, the truth, and the life.